Wait, how many subscribers? Ah! This is the Cave Dweller, aka Minecraft's most terrifying mob. It can squeeze through one block gaps. It can run faster than an Enderman. It can even make the most terrifying noise known to man. <laughs> I'm out of here, man. But even though it's so terrifying, literally every single YouTube under the sun has killed it. And I think that's kind of sad. So instead, I had the great idea to tame the cave dweller and give it a better life as my pet. We're in, baby. Let's go. Now, the caves are kind of known to be a dangerous place. And especially since, you know, the cave dweller's here now. So before I could enter, I had to get a little bit of resources. Oh, I've got another portal. Let's see. Ooh, and it has 50 iron nuggets. You know what? Don't mind if I do. I instantly crafted all the iron into a sword and a pickaxe. That way I'm ready if the cave dweller tries to run up on me. <laughs> I'm so sorry for that one. But thanks to that, it's 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 about the time. I'm gonna head to the caves. <gasps> Cave! Oh wait, no mob spawner. Oh, name tag, name tag, name tag. Huh. That's not a name tag. Now, the reason why I needed a name tag is because that is how I'm gonna tame the cave dweller. See, cave dwellers are kind of like axolotls. You can't technically tame them, but by slapping a name tag on them, bad boys, you theoretically own them. Oh, this is terrifying. I've had so many failed attempts. Please make this one be the last one. Ah! Ugh. There we go. Got him. Okay, I need a torches. I don't have coal. Frick. Okay, there we go. I am no longer legally blind. Oh boy. Oh, hold up. Wait a minute. This is such a bigger cave. Oh, I heard the MF. Where are you? Idiot. Close up. Ah! Oh! 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 I cannot die already. There's so much to live for. And to make sure of that, I got myself some iron gear. Sure. I'm fully dripped out now. Look at that. I look so good, dude. All right, time to get back to it. Can I, can I make that jump? <gasps> Yes, I can. I am the goat. Now, the thing I was looking for was a mine shaft, since I'm pretty sure that those are the only structures that could tame a name tag on the ground, you know, other than the mob spawners. But let me tell you, finding one of these, it took its time. Woo, a mine shaft. Time to get that name tag. Let's see, name tag. Oh, no, we got loading though. Minecart. Ah! These are actually the most terrifying cave noises. These are more terrifying than the normal cave noises. I'm not even gonna lie. Man, why is there no goddamn name tag, bro? I'm gonna have to speak with this place's manager. I swear they're not that rare, right? Please someone comment like the rarity chances of getting a name tag in a mineshaft chest. Okay, name tag, three, two, one. God damn it! I am not kidding when I say that I searched this mine shaft for 20 minutes and I didn't find a goddamn thing. But just as I was about to give up, Yes! Name tag! <laughs> Sorry, got a little bit excited there. Now I need iron for an anvil. See, to name something with a name tag, you first gotta name the actual name tag. And to do that, we need an anvil. Wait, how many is it? <laughs> ah! Oh, oh! Now what do you mean? Oh, don't look at me like that, bro. I'm not into that. I'm, I'm feeling a little bit of tension here. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to put you down. Okay, um, that's the guy we're trying to trap and befriend. Um, I think we have a little bit, need a little bit more couples therapy before that's gonna happen. Oh, and do not worry, even though it looks like I killed the cave dweller, he is still very much alive. No matter what you do, he will always, and I mean always, come back. Okay, enough with the over dramatizing. I quickly cooked up all of my iron and crafted up the anvil. Let's go. Here comes the important question though. What do I name it? Like, I could name him something cool like Thor, or something a little more chill like Oliver, or I can name him Bob. There you go. Now it's time to tame him. And I actually had an epic idea for this. I am gonna use his own powers against him. So, you remember how he can like squeeze through one block gaps? Well, I thought if I made a little hole underneath that gap, he would just crawl right through and plop right into the cage. Oh, but Rasmus, how are you gonna get through the one block gap yourself when you're incredibly large and humongous muscles get in the way? I hear you asking. Well, if you're not gamer, cause I got a boat. So, with that plan in mind, I began making the cage. Okay, this should be big enough for our room. Okay, let's begin decorating. I'm gonna have the dinner table right here. Boom, like that, that's a dinner table. And then we're gonna have fancy uh, stone stairs. Listen, they're the designer, so you know, they're not really comfortable, but they look awesome. The kitchen is gonna be right there. And then the little flower. Do I have dirt? I do not have dirt. Gosh darn it, we're gonna have to go out and find dirt. Hello, I need dirt. Uh, nope. Nope, and nope. God damn it, bro. Where's the, why is there no dirt? <gasps> oh, there's dirt! Oh my, I barely noticed that, bro. Water bucket. I just died. Um, That's not even the worst part of it all. Some of the items and the lava right next to me. Dude, I know it doesn't sound like it, but I was high-key panicking that the name tag didn't fall in the lava. <sighs> Reminded to myself, never MLG again. Uh, I think I'm lost. 
You know what? No, I don't think I'm lost. I know. So I quickly stopped the recording and pulled it up to see exactly where I entered the cave. So I go over to a spruce. Nope, I don't go over to a spruce. I go that direction. Gotcha. Okay, I think I know where I have to go now. I really hope the name tag didn't burn. If the name tag burned, I will violently cry everywhere. Okay, we back in this. God damn it! I can't die. Not like this. Not like this. Okay. Mm, oh. I did it again. Now, you think I might have learned to not take any risk from the previous deaths? Oh, you know, this one? But no, I decided to rush in again and again and again until finally I wasn't a bozo and I actually took my time. Yes! Life is good. Life is great. Did the name tag burn? That is a question. <gasps> no, the name tag's good. Okay, we're chilling. I didn't get any dirt though. I was up there so many times that I forgot to bring dirt. Man! There you go. I've got the dirt. Boom, we got the lily of the valley. Oh my god, this is so cute. I can't wait for the dweller to live in this house. Okay, I think everything is ready. It's set in place. Now it's time to get the lanky guy. Now, there's no way to control when the cave dweller spawns. So all I could really do is just wait and wait and wait until finally. Oh, there he is. I see him, Bob. Follow me, Bob. Are you chill? Wait, is Bob chill? Bob, how did you do that? Bro, Bob is hacking. Apparently, Bob isn't always mad and sometimes just decides to teleport away. So, um, time to wait even longer. Whee! Just slowly but surely. Bro. Oh! Is, is he here? Oh, he's here! Bob! Bob! Hello, Bob! Yeah, I'm gonna lead you to your new home. Follow me, Bob. <gasps> Bob, Bob, Bob! Yes, I'm in. I'm in. Okay, there he is. Bob, come here. I have got him! I got Bob! Holy crap, Bob! Bob, my beloved. Wait. Wait, where did he go? Wait, Bob disappeared. Brody still despawns with a name tag. God damn it. 